my cell phone is through. Your 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 when you enter into Ghana's social media trends, the topmost hashtags that you are going to see is free the citizens and stop Galamse. These are the most popular hashtags on our socials today. Today, as at the time I'm recording this particular video, is the 3rd of October 2024. And in Ghana, it is there is a demonstration going on of which it is supposed to or it is scheduled to last from the 3rd of October through to the 5th of october and it is all about a protest organized by a group called democracy hub and some citizens of ghana all in the quest to protest against illegal mining popularly known as galamsey in the country and even as that an earlier one has already gone down of which some protesters have been arrested and been detained in fact they were arraigned before court somewhere last week and have been remanded for two weeks in uh, police or prison custody this has angered so many of the youth or the other protesters that were not arrested of which some have even come to join the protest or to petition the attorney general to free the citizens as the hashtag will say and also the quest for the government to do something about illegal mining well as this demonstration is going on the people have hit the streets. They started from the Legon, University of Ghana, Legon, the streets around there, through to, they said they are going through. The, so they've outlined some of the principal streets that they are going to walk through. I have some videos, some shots, including some interviews, but I have a response. Some people who are involved in the illegal mining, popularly known as Galamse, in the midst of this protest, who are also Ghanaians, have responded. And in fact, they are not only responding to the government, but also responding to some citizens in the space. I have all those videos for you. So while some people are hitting the streets, protesting, actually calling on the government to do something about the illegal mining, leaving their jobs, others are also there responding to it. In fact, explaining why they are indulging in the illegal mining. This and many more is what we are going to discuss today on Info Day Podcast with me, Roland Amati, live on Roland Report. So if you're watching or listening for the first time, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share this content with others so they can equally enjoy. And also know that this show is sponsored by Ghana's number one right here in Abshagzi. Go on your Google Play Store, your App Store, download the app today, sign up with just 20 Ghana cities, whatever you earn, whatever you get is for you. You pay no commission to anybody as a driver and that's what you send, you tend to enjoy. And if you're a rider, you're looking for the most secure, safe and affordable ride on the market, then know that Shaxi has got you covered. Let's go straight into today's topic. So like I said, it is all about the free the citizens and stop galamse democracy now first it started with stop galamse now but now free the citizens because some citizens or some people who were part of the protesters have been arrested and according to the ghana police service they were involved in the destruction of public property and disturbance of public peace of which they were arrested for but then the citizens are also not in a good light at all they are taking this not in a good taste at all because some of these people are family members and they believe these are constitutional rights or civic rights of the citizens so how do you arrest them when they tend to protest well in the early mornings of today or in the early hours of today there are people or some media houses got close to some people or some of the people involved in the protest to share their views on what the agenda is from the 3rd of October to the 5th of October. You know, we are nearing election. So in the next episode, I am going to do an editorial and share my view or my candid view or observation on this whole bruhaha on Galamse, stop Galamse now and free the citizens on whether or not I support these things or not. But then let's go take a quick highlight into some of the things that have been going on on the 3rd of october as far as the stop galam say now free the citizens protest is concerned when we come back i will play you the reaction or the response from people who are actually involved in galam say why they are doing it 
and whether or not they will listen to the protest and stop. Stay and stay. I'll be right back. Well, we are right here at Okonglo where the protest against um, illegal mining of the next one is to free the arrested protesters at the reoccupied Jolobi House protest. But I'm joined here with one of the conveners. Um, what's your name? My name is Brown Sanadachi. Just a quick um, brief. What's today's um, protest? How is it going to be like today? Okay, so today we, we are moving from Okonglo here right to the sports stadium's uh, car park. And then we are going to use the route from Association International to uh, Gold House, then we join the Hilalima Highway straight through AU Runabout Parliament and then to a uh, uh, stadium. Okay, and yeah. today, what are the demands for today? What are you okay, uh, seeking so, to demand today? Okay, so today we are petitioning Attorney General's office to act promptly on the unconstitutional conduct of state authorities and to release the detained protesters. Okay. That is for today. Okay. Um, uh, today is not about the, the Galamse. It's so actually we, about so collectively the, freeing we, the protesters. Coll collectively, we are uh, putting our voice out there for all the things we have stated in our letter. That is Galamse, unconstitutional conduct, and the release of the uh, protesters. But then, today we are serving petition for only uh, an end to unconstitutional conduct and then the release of protesters.
this or these are some of the reaction from the protest grounds or the place where they were converging in order for them to embark or walk on the protest to petition the attorney general and more but then like i told you the some of the galamse boys have also responded and <laughs> at this point i don't even know what to say or what to do because what they are saying would actually break the heart of some of these citizens that have hit the streets all to protest that ghana will be back on its feet where in the near future or in the coming days we will not be suffering just to get drinking water let's listen to some of the people involved in this galam see what they are saying so that you also share your views in the comment section <laughs> Hey, small boy, oh mamba party say me I. Me wa hundi ntina wa ma kumi ma me kumio. Me si se ukreti nyuma ne, yebe jai galane, ni edi etu zina begu ho. Me si se ukreti nyuma ne, yesu yebe jai galane, ni edi etu zina begu from. Hey, farm boy, me kujari ye. Me wa hundi ntina ho ma komu ma me kumio. Abai, we de nyas wa dio. My humble plea. Hey, galam se fo bro. Me kujari. Abai be. At this point, I am even speechless. I don't even know what to say because is it because a bra na say thing. Because at this point, you don't know who really have or who really has the country at heart is it the politicians that we are blaming or the citizens ourselves do these people understand the future consequences of these actions or you say when men are pushed to the point of survival nothing else matters to them share your views in the comment section let me hear from you let me know what you think about the response from these guys the protest and whatever is going on and if there are any solutions to these problems, how do you think or what are the solutions that you would suggest? For the protection or for the protest influences some top people who are very loud on social media have all joined the campaign, including celebrities. But then share your views in the comment section. I would also love or would want to hear from you. Share your views in the comment section. Let me know what you think about the Stop Galam Say Now protest and the freeze the citizens protest ongoing um in ghana or in accra until then my name is roland amati thanks for spending time with me of course i'll meet you on the highway see you when i see you bye bye you're my job hot assembly hey